ancient historical Kalakonda diamond, fully certified. This particular stone is amazing. The optical brilliance traveling through this D flawless will blow your head off. If you can see the crystal structure is different than the D flawless diamonds around it. What it is, is that stone or the stones that come from the Kalakonda region, the historical diamonds of the world, were something called a type 2A diamond. Type 2A diamonds have a lack of nitrogen within the crystal structure. So what it does is create optical brilliancy beyond any other diamond in the world. These are historical stones. Originally, this was a 3.42 carat. Cat has now cut it to a 1.16 D flawless. Do you know how many Kalkonda D flawlesses in circulation? There are almost none because back in the day, hundreds and hundreds of years ago, if you look at the historical cutting, they didn't go for clarity as much as they went for just, you know, shape. A lot of rose cuts. She's had to recut a lot of, you know, off weird, you know, historical European cuts, but Kat cuts them down to the perfect D flawless with her engineers, gets them recertified at the GIA and that's what you've got here. So you've got basically a Kalkonda 1.16 carat D flawless, the rarest in a historical stone, almost unheard of, right? Surrounded by 2.59 carats of D flawless diamonds. I mean, those diamonds around this particular piece, look at the size of the D flawless, almost 15 pointers surrounding that solitaire as well. So just the 15 pointers will set you back at least you know, mid, mid to, you know, four, five, six thousand a carat. So you're looking at this particular mount alone coming in at close to 16 to 18,000 for the mount. What are you going to pay for a one carat up Kalkonda D flawless? I can tell you right now, they're just not available. There's just nothing out there because these are historical stones. But if you like rare and you like collectible, this hits all the marks.